siguro yung mga uh, pinaka-memorable na experience ko sa PBA yung first championship win then yung PBA Asia uh, yung nag-qualify sa World versus Korea siguro yun yung di ko makakalimutan First of course yung na-draft ako na kasi siguradong PBA player <laughs> PBA player na ako and then the next one is yung champ first champ tuwan-tuwa ako na nakakuha ko yung champ Ang mas naalala ko yung 2002 eh, nag-champion kami. Uh, yun yung first year ko sa Purple. Sa so, Sapos, may memorable na ano, sa, sa buhay ko, sa career ko. Ito na yun. Uh, nasama sa ano, sa 43 display. So, Perhaps was the first championship that I won. Uh, because a uh, different feeling. Uh, and uh, something that uh, I will always remember. All the time. Of course, um, yun first um, champion to Safi Bay with um, Coach Ryan. Uh, kasi kumbaga, galing nga kasi ako ng year 21 noong time na yun. And then si Coach Ryan kumbaga, bigay niya ako ng more playing time. So, kumbaga, utang ko rin sa kanya lahat eh. At talagang pinagsikapan ko rin yun. What makes me uh, unique or, or, or great? Um, it's a good question. Uh, I think... You know, I've just really prided myself uh, you know, throughout my entire life on uh, really you know, working hard. Um, you know, I've never really been blessed with the, the height or the heft to, to play this game, but you know, I, I fell in love with it uh, at a very young age, and I figured you know, my, my work ethic would, would help carry me through. Siguro yung, the way I play, yung passion, yes, uh, yes. leadership, being one, one with my teammates, yun ang pinakagusto ko. Probably the most uh, unforgettable moment of my career uh, happened in 2005 when we won the All Filipino Championship with Nebra. Uh, we beat Talk in Texas six games, and uh, I was the MVP of the of the finals. Uh, and it, was, it was my our first All Filipino Championship, and that's all that meant the most. Honestly, probably being drafted, I think was. It's up there. There's a lot, but I think being drafted is one of my highs. Uh, just because I didn't think I was going to be in the PBA, uh, I moved away. I went back home, and then I, uh, a lot of stuff happened, and I ended up getting in the PBA. Well, of course, Grand Slam. And then, the greatest moment. So, that's it. I can't imagine that really, uh, Dati sa probinsya na ako, laro-laro lang, diba sa kalye. And then ngayon, kasama na ako sa isa sa pinakamagaling na 40, diba? 40 great display. I uh, guess we'll be tonight. Uh, never expected this to be part of the 40th greatest players. Uh, you know, when you come in, you, ha you have high dreams and goals and win championships. But it's unbelievable to get this feeling. Uh, you know, to be uh, lost for words right now. Yeah, you know, people appreciate the hard work you put in through the years. Um, I told my wife earlier tonight, this is by far better than me winning an MVP. And, you know, my MVP, my championship, I gotta set those aside. I think I set those awards aside compared to tonight. Tonight is just awesome, unbelievable. Um, I think, you know, two two moments in my career that stand out uh, would definitely be uh, our three feet with the All Filipino. Um, I was uh, blessed and lucky enough to be a, a part of a very, very special group of guys who, you know, really epitomize the, the idea of, of selflessness and, and character and, and really hard work. And of course, you know, my experience with the national team, uh, you know, the experience here in Cuba, Asia against Korea, and of course being in Spain uh, for the World Cup. Uh, those are memories that, that not only myself and my family were able to share, but I think we were able to share those particular moments with, with everyone here in our country. And uh, something very special to, to me and my family and hopefully to everyone. What makes me great? That's a good question. Um, I, don't, I don't see myself as great. I honestly don't. Um, God is great and it's, it's because of him that I'm here. I'm still fighting back tears and, and just, a, just a flow of emotions. Uh, with all the things that's been happening for me uh, in my life the last four or five years with, with medications and sicknesses and, and things like that, having to deal with that. Um, to be standing here today, it's just like, uh, it's, it's, it's 
almost a, a relief from the culmination of all the things that's happened. So, um, 